So first off, you're going to take the orange container off the shelf in the puppy room just from above the crate. And you'll notice on the lid there are some laminated instructions. Take out the sheet corresponding to the day. Today is Tuesday, March the 21st, and we're going to be making lunch the first time the puppies have kibble. So we'll take out the sheet, and then inside the box there will be yellow, green, and blue bags. If you're making breakfast, it'll be blue. We're making lunch, so we're going to get the yellow bag, and it has a date on it. It clearly says it's the 21st. So we'll take our bag. We no need, longer need the box. We're going to put the ground kibble into either a clean puppy bowl or a plastic container, something that will tolerate stirring and hot water. Empty the bag completely, and then you'll get hot water out of the faucet in the kennel, and you're going to mix hot water into the kibble to make a thick paste. And you're going to then leave it for two minutes to absorb the water because the kibble will absorb it and expand and we want most of the expansion in the bowl, not in the puppy's tummy. So just add. And you can see it's like a sludge. It's like a thick, boring consistency. Leave that to one side and then you're going to locate the goat's milk powder. Inside there there is a scoop. And referring back to our chart, today is the one bag of kibble, kibble with one and a half scoop of goat's milk with three quarters a cup of warm water. So it's a loosely packed scoop. So there's one scoop into the container marked mixing for goat's milk. And then our half scoop, you'll have to eyeball it, our half scoop. And to that, we're adding three quarters of a cup we have a set of cups, so take the quarter cup and put in three measures of warm water. One, two, three. Place the lid on the pot and holding tight, you're going to swirl that round to dissolve the goat's milk. There, that's ready. And then what we're going to do See how that's thickened up? We're actually now going to add a tad more water just to loosen that up a little bit. Oops. That's the sort of consistency you'll want. And from there we're going to take our goat's milk and we're going to... Actually I'm going to mix it the other way because my bowl's too small. Pour your kibble into your goat's milk and stir it. And you're going to get like a gruel. It's still a very liquid consistency. And when that's thoroughly mixed, you're going to take your puppy feeding ring and you're going to pour that in. Any bits left behind will scrape out. And there we have puppy lunch. Or breakfast or dinner, depending which you're making.